Play. Salax, I think, pushed back to third. It's oh, and a doubt, a faller, and it's, that's taken three guys down already. I think one of the unfortunate, the unfortunate picked up in that because one. Yeah, one guy had made a tiny mistake, and it might just be that track temperature caught him out. Wasn't really expecting, and of course, a little bit offline into the first turn there. So it's a different line, and that is uh, one of the that was but that brothers. was Jan Onku. On that was uh, Jan, but we saw him actually then get up and walk and get back on the motorcycle. So he winner from this race from last year. In fact, he's already opened up a few bike lengths. And then there's a Another faller there on the exit of that very, very fast right-hander. Luckily, everybody's missed him, and he's up here just in the background there. You see the bit of a bobble with the front end of that machine, and uh, really just didn't recover. He really didn't do anything wrong. He just hit a bump, and then the, the back of him, and it's playing into Rory. It's only down a faller behind, and that's while it Sopper goes down, and he takes uh, the other rider the with him, track. I think. It you see them at the back there, yeah, big high side from Waller, just kind of opened the throttle there early in the corner, trying to get a drive on the start finish. The two at the front having a bit of a bubble, but of course, poor old Masaki had nowhere to go. And here's a and here's so you can see that's Waller in the green helmet. Opens the throttle, right hand there, both. It's a fine line. It's the camber's changing all the way out of that it corner. It's so exceeding track limits. That's is Rory Skinner out there, and he sweeps back across. Oh dear! And of course, dear, yeah, dear. Rory just misjudged that he there was a rider couldn't see. No, he he does. He's still got eight seconds. Oh, and there's a fall. Wallace Sopper is one of those. Uh, the green helmet of Wallace Sopper, and it obviously was. We saw Chan on Jew have a have a nasty slide. The other one uh, is Carrasco. Adrian Carrasco. Disaster for Wallace Sopper. And there's another faller there. Uh, so there's another bite down, and uh, you. Uh, this last lap when the rain came down, second to last lap, and yeah, totally out with their control. They arrived at part of the track uh, that happened to be raining out. There was no warning. Um, the guys had no warning at all. The, the track was slippy there, and, and down they went. And Here's their yeah. last ba German battle down to the chicane. Megley goes in and loses. Oh, uh, independently. You know, is that psychological when you see the guy in front or do they, do they were just was so lacking? He'll be devastated to go down there. Looked like it was just in the back of that bunch. It looks like penultimate corner, very fast there. Maybe but Challenger has advantage. Overview up the inside. Oh, and they touch Zayagura. again. There goes Agura. That yep. was most unfortunate. Just a product of the fact that there are Feature so many in the battle for the, in, for the win. In through the left here. You see it. Agura just up the inside. They're on the edge of the tire. It doesn't advantage. take much. And he lost oh, the front. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A little bit Ripley turning into the chicane there. That you see the front Who bobbling pulls around. Up alongside Kevin Orgis as they go down to the first corner. Ayagura thinks to go inside him into the second part of the corner. He does, but oh, Yamanaka and yes, and then uh, Ayagura goes down for the second time this weekend. Left to get a nice run on the start finish. Ayagura goes to his right side and just gets on the throttle and he kind of had to pick it up and lean it over and the front end actually tucked first and then the rear come round. It's a long, sort of straightish section here. Jan looking for an outbreaking possibility. Oh, and down they go. Jun Ju is one of the fallers there. Chan and Ju is one of the fallers. Didn't see who the others can't quite. Oh, and there's a big schmozzle there. And I think it's quite likely we'll have the race stop because there are bikes all over the place. Back limits there. Here's a replay into the. Oh, and it was the inside there. It. Yeah, it was at least viewed down the yeah. inside of Chan on Chu. Chan on Chu on the brakes. So it maybe just braked a little bit early. At least views. Oh, oh, they, they well just clipped. Actually yeah, it was separate. They didn't actually go down together, but then down they went. Fortunately, they're okay. And yeah, there's just a, a big collision as he exited that corner as well. Obviously, pushed back to about eighth it. place, but is now in right. back in the lead. Oh, yeah, that's number eleven, Giannini. He actually crashed out on his own. I think this incident on the first lap bunch in, in the back there looks like Wallace Sopper there. He goes the instant victim there. Uh, yeah, number 13 getting taken out there. Really oh, unlucky. And he's walking away from the machine. Oh, and there, yeah, it looked like it was, he did that all on his own. That looks like coming onto the back straight there, is it? The, the right hander on board, the channel on Duke. Oh, yeah, tight right hander there. It's first gear corner. You've cut back to the throttle on the edge of the tyre and his animal. And interestingly, Neil, you know, they're settled into a one sort of. Ooh. Oh, down! Yes, that's Omar Benoli, the local hero. What a tragedy for him. Riding such two, a good race. Turn two, turn three, Benoli. Uh, just at the back there, just squeezing the throttle but we'll be back just in a action bit, tomorrow uh, just maybe at the rear of the picture just slides out really a little bit wide there maybe in the dirty part of the track that's the very last corner really fast entry there you're kind of covering the top 10 still from oh and down goes uh, 
Ayagura, I think, and he's taken somebody else with him. Yamazaki's down. Get to the, the finish. Two on board here into this tight left after the long, long left. And then uh, Bobble, there's a bump in the middle of that corner right at the apex, and it looked like, was that Agura or Masaki? It was Agura who caught it. Yeah, you're yeah, on board with Masaki. Just destabilized the bike. Masaki's front wheel caught the rear wheel of Agura's bike and had nowhere to go. So no one really made it. Here you go, Neil. Through the right, then onto the left. Tried so hard to push just to get a nice drive, and rear end went really early, pretty much middle of the corner there, just when he cracks the throttle. Right.